hi guys welcome to my channel so today i'm gonna be making a clutch out of a placemat this placemat i got it from walmart it was uh, 99 cents i'm showing you some of the few supplies there are more things there are more supplies i'm gonna be using along the way but i'll have all of them linked down below um so i'm using one placemat to make the clutch and as you see i'm cutting the placemat into two if you're new to my channel, my name is Emma. On my channel, you'll find all sorts of videos. You'll find DIY, crafting, sewing, nursing information because I'm a nurse also. So basically anything that interests me, you'll find it on my channel. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe down below. Um, so I've already cut the placemat into two and I'm just measuring to mark uh a center of this other the of this place man <laughs> can't talk <laughs> So this is going to be the front of the clutch. So I'm cutting on um, opposite ends to almost kind of give it like a V shape. Um, that will cover, is more of like a little style to um, add onto the clutch. So I'm doing, I folded it so I can have more of a, ex, the exact same measurement. And I'm cutting that side. And then I'm going to, I'm just making sure that both sides were cut evenly. And then I'm going to start um, adding the fabric. So I am cutting the fabrics now. Um, I'm cutting two, two fabrics. Because one is going to go in the front and then one will go in the back. And I'll be using the mud patch to apply these fabrics. So this whole project is no sew. Everything is Mod Podge. I love Mod Podge, guys. As you guys can already see from my previous DIY videos, Mod Podge are the best thing that was ever <laughs> invented. Um, so what I'm doing now is I'm getting, I'm cutting the side pocket for the clutch. I'm just, I folded, this is the second half uh, second piece of the um, of the placemat so I'm just cutting the side pieces which are going to go later on on the clutch so each I'm cutting uh, two of this folded in half so one side is gonna have uh, one fabric which will be folded in half and the other folded in half as well and this is the magnet snap button that I'm gonna be using to secure the purse once I'm finished with it to be for the purse to be able to close so what basically I did I just kind of created a landmark as to where it's gonna go before I apply the fabric because once I apl apply the fabric then I'm gonna go back and dig the hole into the fabric so that I know where to put the button
so what I'm doing is, as you see, I'm kind of bending, folding almost kind of the uh, placemat. The reason why I'm doing this is one, when the um, mud patch dries on the fabric, it kind of makes the whole thing stiff. So I'm kind of bending it as I go to give it more of a flexibility so that the fabric is, you know, able to move, to be easily to move versus it just being stiff and um till it gets dry it went if i didn't if you don't do this the fabric gets really stiff and then whatever material that you're using also gets stiff which makes it a little harder for you to complete your project I'm now going ahead and applying the first magnet button. So earlier when I made a landmark, I just went back and dug through that landmark to make a hole through the fabric. And then this is gonna be the front of the clutch. Now I'm going ahead to install the second magnet button. I'm just going back into the original landmark that I made and putting in the second magnet button. So we are halfway done. Um, I'm just placing the magnet button now and making it, making sure it's secure. Look at that. Already looking all cute. Yeah, I'm just going to secure the button, make sure that it's in place, nice and neat. And then we're going to put that aside and move on to the second half of the placemat.
Remember the little side piece I mentioned cutting earlier? Well, this is where it's going to come into place. So I'm going to glue um, this these pieces on each side of the uh, placemat. So I'm going to use, of course, the mud patch and apply the fabric, making sure they are both secure on both sides. all right look at it so we are halfway through almost there and that is how it look i'm going to do the same thing on the other side which i did and now it's time to attach that piece to the other piece um so yeah i'm just going to um apply a lot of mud patch onto that side onto that piece and then apply the second piece to it and um I'm going to use a cloth hanger uh, to connect um, both together and let it sit for about 30 minutes. 30 minutes, 20 to 30 minutes should do. And one great thing about Mud Patch, again, guys, is that it works really good. It dries fast, so it's just awesome. I just love it. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm done with that. I'm just now applying uh, both pieces together. And that is basically, I'm going to give it 30 minutes and I'll come back and show you guys the final result.
all right so this is all done and guys this is so cute it is the cutest little clutch ever um it's so very light and the color is just so playful i love the playfulness to the color and ladies you can wear this to like a cocoa you can wear it to a nice little date you know it's just it's cute i i freaking love it um so if you're interested in this um it's basically first come first serve this video is going to be uploaded on monday so if you're interested just my email will be down below so just link me uh emails shoot me an email um you know if you're interested with your address and i will do the drawing of whoever how many people send me in your email i'll do a drawing and then whoever wins i'll send you back an email to send me a little cash app for just the mailing cost and again if you are new to my channel i welcome you and please go ahead and subscribe down below and thank you for watching this video and i'll see you in my next video